Improper ash disposal causes thousands of fires each year. With the continued use of wood-burning fireplaces and stoves, along with an increasing use of outdoor fire pits and other heating devices, Truckee Meadows Fire Protection District would like to remind you of the proper way to dispose of your leftover ashes. Even after several days, a pile of ashes can hold enough heat to reignite and start a fire. Three days is the minimum recommended cooling period for ashes. Extra care should be used in the storage and final disposal. When disposing of ashes, use the following procedure. All ashes should be stored in a fire-resistant metal container. This helps prevent air from blowing through and disturbing ashes, which can leave hot coals exposed for reigniting. Never store ashes in a cardboard box or plastic bag. Make sure there are no hot spots left in the ashes. This is done by soaking them in water and stirring. Wet down the ashes and any wood pieces in the can. Use enough water to saturate the materials in the bucket so they are thoroughly wet. There's no need to have standing water in the bucket, but it doesn't hurt. As long as you're okay with a little mess, you can use as much water as you want. Place the lid on the can and allow the ashes to sit for at least three days. And don't forget to ensure the surface area of the previous fire or burn area is thoroughly extinguished. The metal container should be placed on a non-combustible surface and away from anything flammable. It should not be placed next to a firewood pile in the garage or under a wood deck or porch. After sitting for at least three days in the metal container, cautiously check the exterior of the can to ensure it is cool to the touch. If so, the ashes are then safe to dispose of in your trash. Fireplace ashes can also be used to help maintain the neutral condition of the compost in your garden. It can also add nutrients to the soil. Approved containers are available at local retailers or for free at one of the Truckee Meadows fire stations. Thank you for watching and remember to be fire safe.